Yo guys, what is up? It's Teach here, coming at you again with another video, and I am here right now to show you some really cool stuff. We are on Crystal Isles officially. This is kind of the map right here. They've changed the map around quite a bit. It's something that, I mean, I just logged in, so I haven't seen what they've changed yet, but it is something that's going to be really unique because before we didn't have like these distinct biomes. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and check it out. It looks like it's enormous. This map is going to be gigantor. So we're going to go ahead and spawn in and see what it looks like. I'm not entirely sure what it's going to be, but, you know, it's kind of how this game works. The first couple of, I don't know, weeks, months, whatever you want to call it, no one knows what's really going on. Oh, they changed the water. Yes, it's no longer green. Um, the water was green beforehand, and you could see through it, so it looks like they fixed the water. Uh, that's awesome. Let's go ahead and go in there to make sure. Yeah, they fixed the water. Oh, happy day. Let's go ahead and... Wow, it's an insta-death. Do not spawn in the north zone. Bad idea. North zone is not safe, as it turns out. All right, let's see what they left in. So it looks like they took a little bit of the map out, but not that much. They left a huge amount of stuff in. Wow, okay, that's awesome. I'm glad that they left all this stuff in. No, they... I didn't... I thought they would leave it in, but take parts of it out. Wow, they left the entire section of the map in over here where it's kind of like the crystal water dinos look at this this is cool they even fixed it so it's not laggy and glitchy when you get over here it's not raining whoa look at this Bloop. inside the bubble we go so there is some cool stuff over here i will show you this in a video later but i mean my goodness there's some really unique stuff over here other than being like electrocuted to death, it's a pretty cool area. Uh, tons and tons of resources. It looks like they left in the crystals. Can I harvest these? It looks like I can. So some of the special resources still exist. So we'll see how that works. All right, floating islands. Let's check these out. Oh, look at this. They made them. Oh, this is cool. So they kind of like prettied them up a little bit here. They added in some of this like pink feature, some of the trees. Wow, I didn't think they'd add this in. Cool. They kind of like, on Valguero, the first like month or two, what they did is they didn't really fix any of the scenery. It looks like the first thing they did when they were updating this map was fix the actual scenery, add all kinds of trees and stuff. Look at this. This is an island right here. Oof, duh. That is unique. I like it. I like it a lot. It's cool. Whew. That's cool. All right. So anyways, these floating islands are going to be amazing. They took out the Rock Drake, so I'm a little curious to see what they put in the Rock Drake Zone. Is that a Tropignathus? Nope, that's a Quetzal. Is that a Tropognathus? Nope, that's a Tapiara. Or it, is it? Yep, that's a Tapiara. All right, so looks like the colors are biome specific as well. So that's kind of cool. Uh, this is going to be a cool base spot right here. Uh, eventually, if someone ends up taking that. Let's go ahead and go inside of this little island right here. So if you go underneath this, you can actually get inside the island. Um, so it loads in. Yeah, they took the rock drake out. Uh, so sad. I don't even, did they leave the nests in though? Yeah, they left the rock drake nest locations in. Like this right here, there's a rock drake nest. Um, this is a great area to get metal. If you haven't seen my metal video, down on this like floor down here, I mean, it obviously hasn't spawned in quite yet, but there is a ton of metal that spawns down here. Absolute load of metal. All right, let's see here. Yep, so that's pretty cool. So they left that in. Uh, Crystal Wyvern spawn down here. Maybe, maybe they don't, according to this map. Uh, cool. So they left uh, at least that zone in the map, so that's pretty cool. Let's go and check out what else they added. <coughs> Sorry, still early in the morning, so I'm coughing a little bit. All right, we've got the jungle zone. Wow, they kind of added a whole bunch in look at this so in my last video they kind of like forgot about this zone the iso crystal isles because they just didn't include all the shrubbery and stuff like that but they added it all back in and looks beautiful look at this red crystal easy to access yes please unique flowers do you get anything from these no it's just normal flowers cool this map is so cool Ah, uh, this is the first time they've had floating islands unique biomes like unique truly unique biomes not like uh, typically in maps, things cluster together. Like you get these, uh, I don't want to gain experience, so I'm just going to go ahead and do that. Uh, you get, the map looks similar the entire way across. This one is just so varied and 
unique oh, water well up here too. Nice. That uh, you're not going to find anything similar in all the biomes. They're all going to be pretty specialized. This is cool. All right, let's check this out down here. You got some river function going on. There's going to be tons of little hidden alcoves and base locations in this area. I can tell you that already. Woofta. My goodness. Wow, that's cool. All right, so let's keep going here. Um, looks like we got through the jungle. There's the floating islands. There's the blood forest, the volcano. Let's check out the wyvern and griffin scar. I'm a little curious to see what they've done over here. What have they taken out? Have they taken out the griffins? Please tell me you didn't take out the griffins. No. They did. Unless they haven't spawned in yet, which is possible, I guess. The nests are still here. Thorny dragons are still here. Did you take out the griffins, Ark? Please tell me you didn't. I'm just going to hope that they, they didn't. And th that's the case. There, there's RGs. Things are spawning in. Wait a minute. Is that a griffin? <gasps> they didn't take out the griffins. Yes, score. Score, 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 score. That's amazing. All right, so they kept the griffin canyon in. That's so dope. I don't see any other griffins in here, but this is where, like, probably 150, 200 griffins spawn. This entire canyon is just layered with griffins. There they are. There as they are. Starting to spawn in. If you use these nests with a whip, actually, you can get a bunch of crystals, all kinds of stuff. Um, I'll show you here. Stone, stone, stone. You just have to find the right spots, but there's, there's other things in these nests sometimes. So, all right. Griffins are still in. Yes, make my freaking day i love griffins on this map let's take a screenshot of this because i'm happy they left this in i was worried they were going to take it out but they left it in so that's pretty awesome all right so let's keep going we've got the griffin scar did they leave i would assume they left the normal wyverns in here because they don't really take out the wyverns griffins are something they typically take out okay wyvern canyon is right here inside of this i'm not seeing any wyverns yet so that's upsetting Please. Ah, they left the wyverns. It, look at the colors on that one. My goodness, that is cool. Oh, are these special wyverns? So it looks like they have a blood wyvern in here with a regular wyvern. Oh, these are both special wyverns. Look how fast they are. So the, they kept the speed of the crystal wyverns. What? That's cool. All right, so I'm glad they kept that speed. I'm hoping they left in the normal wyverns, but I'm not entirely sure. They may have just like replaced all the spawns in here with uh, the crystal wyverns. And that's something that's possible. So we'll see how that works. Wow, that's cool. Okay, so they've left in crystal wyverns at least. They left in the griffins. They left in the scars. Let's check out the white cliffs zone. See if there's anything different really. Looks like it's pretty much the same. Lots of high, high, awesome, huge, like these are just huge, monstrous base locations. So that's pretty cool. Um, what else did they leave in here? Ooh, is that a lead Sithicus just stuck? Talk about some XP gain. Kill these things. They give you tons and tons of XP. Boom, right there. Get the blubber right off the back of it. You can just walk up to it and harvest. Scrape that meat. Got the fish meat off the side of it, and you can just wait to scrap it again. But, oh well. So, let's keep going. Um... I'm looking to see if I can find a Tropagnathus. I haven't seen one yet. I'm sure they're around. It's just a question. Of, ah, ha, ha, ha. There it is. There's the Tropagnathus. Look at that thing. That is cool. That is really, really cool. Is it aggressive? It is not even aggressive. You can tame this. Oh, man. Oh, man. That's cool. That's really cool. All right. That's unique. I like that. Let's just hide my UI. It doesn't matter if I have it there. So there's the Tropignathus. Looks like they spawn over in the White Cliffs section. So that's pretty friggin' cool. I like that a lot. Ooh, there's some more Crystal Dragons here. Or Crystal Wyverns. And let me see. No, you're not going to let me see the... Oh, the UI's off. That's why. Oh, they're passive tames! You need to be at least level 60. So they kept them as passive. Oh my goodness. They did not. That is amazing. Oh, cool. That is so cool. They kept that in as a passive tame. Make my day. I wonder if you can breed them too. <sighs> Ark, you are making me happy with this update. Sarcos. 
Um, I'm not seeing much else that they changed. It looks like they kept a lot of things the same, and that's really, really awesome of them. All right, so let's go over to the Redwoods Forest. A lot of people forget about the Redwoods Forest, but it's a really awesome spot. Lots of resources. Oh, over here, there's tons of metal, too, if you haven't seen this zone. Uh, I think it's right over here on this mountain. Is this the one I'm thinking of? This might be it. There it is. There's Metal Zone. So basically, if you go down in this like mountainous region, I'll go ahead and show you the map. Uh, kind of right before the Redwood Forest, uh, you have this huge zone with metal in high quality just spawning literally everywhere in this zone. So that's pretty cool. All right, let's keep going. And let's see what else they changed. It looks like they left this zone mostly the same, which is awesome. Uh, it looks like there's a couple of spots you can still hide a mini base in if you're careful. Still have the crystals here. Uh, there's still passive tamed wyverns, which is awesome. This is going to be a cool biome. It's really easy to hide in the redwoods, and people don't really go here that often in most maps. So you're going to have some really neat bases that end up over here. Hidden bases, mind you. Lots of resources. I'm sure there's Thylacolia somewhere just waiting in the trees to kill me. That's cool. Man, full circle around this map. It looks like they've done this Crystal Isles justice, unlike Valguero, where they kind of just pillaged the entire map. This is cool. What is that down there? Is that crystal? Ah, blue crystal. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Unique. Unique, unique, unique. So, for the most part, it looks like they keep... It, the entire map is pretty much the same. It looks like they removed almost nothing. Um, now, here's the real question. Did they keep in the phoenixes? If they kept in phoenixes, that's going to make my day. I don't know why they would have taken them out, but maybe they did. You don't know. They spawn on this mountain in just glorious numbers. Oh, hello. When did this get here? Did they add a cave? Wow, this is a cool base spot. Boom, here you go. Right off the bat, you've got yourself a mini mini cave base spot. Nice. All right, so they added a few things. Um, this is usually where a bunch spawn. Nope, none. Let's see if we can find them. If not, that's kind of the end of this here. Not seeing them, not seeing them yet. Okay, I'm just giving them a second to spawn in just in case they haven't done that yet. Not seeing them again. Sometimes they spawn up on top. Oh, I think they took them out. That's sad. I really like the, them being part of this map. All right, let's try up top one last time. Please. No, I think they took the phoenixes out. That's pretty sad. Oh, well. Pretty cool. I like it. They kept most of the map in. Well, d nice job, Ark. I am, I am very impressed with you. It is unique to have something like this where you guys actually keep some of the funnest parts of the map in. So anyways, hope this video helps you out. And other than that, teach out.